We did. And going live in five, four, three, two. Down in the deep blue sea. Baby beluga in the deep blue sea. Sea deep. You swim so wild and you swim so free. That's all the, that's all the, all I know from Baby Beluga. Theory. I didn't even realize I was singing a song. I just kind oh, of. Oh, really? Wait, is Baby Beluga a, a, a nationwide thing? Like, or sorry, like a, a worldwide thing? Like or? A, is it a lullaby? It's, it's, it's like a sort of like a preschool type of song that you sing. Oh, uh, okay. Um, I didn't have a lot of songs about the ocean in Kansas. You, you didn't, yeah, they don't no. sing, they don't celebrate the ocean in Kansas the way that we do elsewhere. We, we worship the sea here. Uh, and this is Ace of Seafood, and I'm Patrick Gill. I'm Clayton Ashley. So let's take a look at this game that we're playing right now. We're playing this. This game has been out a while on various platforms. Uh, uh, it's on PC, it's on PS4, and it just came out on Switch you a couple weeks take ago. Your fish battling, uh, post apocalyptic, some kind of message game. I don't. I, don't, mm, I think there's something yeah, in here about what we've done to the ocean. It, we're, we're making the ocean battle itself with we're making resources more scarce yes and it's making the the shrimp and the lobsters have to have Ooh, these okay. aerial undersea battles uh so this is this is like ace combat except you're, you're you're a lobster or a sardine or um yeah i've actually got a team with me and so there's dr claw man he's another uh lobster but yeah. i know i got some sardines around here Where's, yeah where are you have they been injured no they're there slick they sammy okay. and garfield yep um, right. So this is your your crack team of of undersea creatures. I want to go up here. Go for it. I'm gonna yeah. check in on Chad. Go find. Hey the Chad. Tank. I think it's my target. I should have reviewed my uh, the mission parameters better. Uh, snorkel. Hey Snorkel. Snorkel. This uh, this is a great great stream for our friend Snorkel the dolphin. Oh. Um, who reminds us to name the fish in our squad, which we have. Yeah, we, we have uh, Slick Sammy, Dr. Clawman, Garfield, and there's a Seinfeld somewhere out there, too. I am the Seinfeld. Oh, you're Seinf you named yourself Seinfeld? I am the Seinfeld. Cool. Uh, how, how's your sea battle here going? It looks like you're taking some damage. Ooh, oh, boy, those sardines are fucking you up. No, I, but you've claimed their DNA for yep. yourself now. I'm just going to stay a little farther away, use my homing missiles. Yeah, yeah, and keep an eye on your stamina out there. You don't want to do too many. Uh, yeah. Oh, you're right. Doing tricks. Okay, get that yeah. DNA. Get that DNA. Hey, it's Dino it's... DNA. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, you want to enter that reef? Uh, okay. Yeah, this see what's in this reef. Tank. Oil tank. It's not. I guess it's. Actually, that's another interesting thing here is that the reef is that happens in real life when when humans leave things on the ocean floor. Mm -hmm. uh, they often become reefs. Sometimes on purpose we do that. Sometimes we litter a lot. Yeah, we do. <laughs> so commence operations. I don't know what the engage reef button does. I've hit it several times, and it, <laughs> to the best of my knowledge, it doesn't really do anything. Okay. But you are okay. So now we are. So these things, I think, are food. Yeah. If, if you shoot them. those yep, up, you'll get, get food and, and resources. I've acquired organic resources. Okay. So yeah, we use those to level up, like slick, slick Sammy and mm -hmm. uh, Doctor Claw and Garfield and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, white items are food. They satisfy your hunger. You must satisfy your hunger. Mm-hmm. I like the, I, I like, I haven't tried the other. So the game has, it, it starts off, lets you pick between, I think, five classes. Uh, mm -hmm. Mackerel, sardine, uh, shrimp. Pretty sure there's barracuda and barracuda, some Barracuda, kinda... I don't think was selectable from the main oh, menu. Okay. Yeah, maybe you need to access that one later. I feel like there's a cephalopod you can be. Maybe a squid or octopus or something. I, I haven't encountered those yet. So the, the front menu gives you shrimp, lobster, sardine, mackerel, and maybe one, maybe cod. Um, those are the, the five starting craft that you can acquire, and then I'm guessing you unlock the rest of them through through combat and gameplay. Uh, yeah. But I like playing as the, the lobster so far, because you sort of feather the left trigger to stay airborne, mm -hmm. um, as opposed to just swimming swimming wherever you want. So you, by default, you're just kind of crawling along the ground here. I'm honestly, this is a this is also kind of a budget game. I think, yeah, I yeah. think it's like 12 or $15 or something. Yeah. But considering that, I'm pretty impressed by this lobster's animation. It's it's fairly it's good, right? Yeah, it's articulated. It can do swimming and it can walk around. It's along got that the side to side wobble. It looks good. Um, how do you feel about lobster? Do okay. The actual thing. Yeah. Now I think this might have been a, a scarcity thing in Kansas, mm -hmm. but the fact that it was scarce 
I did enjoy it. Really? On those rare okay. occasions that we got it. Yeah. I think they're gross. Yeah, I think they're yeah. really gross. Just looking at them makes me angry. I know this, and it's the kind of thing where I, I like I disagree on its taste, but I understand completely why someone from Maine may not still feel that positive about lobster. I've only had it once or twice. I've actually, I've literally had it once. Um, but it's always in your face. It's always in my face, and I'm always seeing them around. And when I go to the grocery store, there's just tanks full of them. I try to and, hand you one when you go to the airport. Oh God, you yeah. can't leave. Take one. Yeah, somebody gives you one, and then they like they try to get money from you. No, that actually doesn't happen. But that would be really funny, <laughs> is if like you land in Maine and someone like a kid like runs up to you and puts a lobster in your a hands, live and they're like, lobster. oh, thank you, and then he's like, ten dollars, ten dollars. Uh, no, that's. A prawn? Prawn, get that prawn, that prawn. There's, there's environmental destructibility. We're just look at fuck this rock up. I'm getting distracted. There's a very busy heads up display in this game. Mm -hmm. But it's a lot of important information. That's like true. We do my photon bullets. Wait, where are? What, what's your, what's <clears> the well, I just, of your I just switched. Bullets? If I switch to the uh, molt. Yeah. Oh yeah, shed shell. So as the oh, lobster, rad. if you shed your shell, it creates a decoy. Mm -hmm. Um but we should probably be firing back at these, these yeah, prawns. I'm, I'm letting my team... Get in there, Slick Sammy. Take on the brunt of this. Oh, these are all decoys. Oh, geez, you, you, you're getting pretty close to being dead. Oh, no. Yeah, you might want to... Oh, shit. Damn. Yo, you got your legs blowed off. That was not a very hardy lobster. You do not need all to right. fight those whose strength you cannot match. There are many paths. This is wise, actually. This it is, is actually yeah. Wisdom. This game is full of uh, old sea wisdom. Um, no, I'm actually kind of in love with this uh, whole UI system. It's very like fut mill sim future tactic sci-fi. Yeah. But it's about a fish game. Right. And there's yeah. something I really enjoy about that. All right, we're going to uh, we're gonna go ahead and rename our Seinfeld because right. I think maybe that was a little bit cursed. Can I get that keypad there? <laughs> yes. Uh, chat, give us a new name for our 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 ship. Um, our our our, our ship. Our ship. Our, our pr primary vehicle here. It's a it's a spiked lobster. Mm -hmm. um, so let us know. Everyone in the chat is just, chat is just typing F because we died. So we're gonna give them yeah. a second. Uh, name ideas for our lobster craft, please. A beard attack. Why does it have a beard attack? A beard attack? Does, do they, is that what they call the weird things underneath a lobster's? That's, oh, they do kind of have little spiny beards. I hate it so much. Yeah, there's. Shep. I mean, I'll say this: there's nothing good looking about a lobster when it's a, a creature. <laughs> no, this this got the just overlapping like pieces of carapace and horrible. I was wondering what you thought in Monster Hunter that the the Diablos kind of reminded me of a giant lobster. It's our, it's like the shell and the back tail. Mm. Gross. It just makes you hate that monster even more. Yeah. Bill, Sarah, Larry. Oh, there's a lot of Larrys being Pinchy, Eat It Joe's, The Gills, Labo. Oh, I like Labo. I, yeah, Labo works. Okay, yeah, we're going to go with Labo. Um, okay. Okay. So this is Labo the Lobster. Yeah, Enter. that's a nice alliteration. Um, and let's, let's see if this helps us do any better. I think we can strengthen. Ooh. Resources, growth, 1%. Okay, all oh, right. Yeah, you got it. Should I just put all of our resources into him? Uh, no, I'm gonna save some resources yeah, for. Yeah, we got a whole team. We're spread. gonna go five percent growth onto La Labo. Mm -hmm. um, and we give one of our. Uh... Yeah, let's power up. Power let's up Garfield. Power up Garfield. Give him some lasagna. Delicious Garfield for lasagna. And with that, ooh, okay, so They're it's much cheaper. cheaper. It's much cheaper to level up. So we'll do twenty percent growth on Garfield. Which also means uh, Garfield has earned a new title. Um, Commander? Garfield X. Garfield X. Uh, All enter. Right. Okay. Uh, close. Plankton pistol. I like, I didn't realize this, that, you know, initially it seems like kind of odd that these fish have lasers and, and homing missiles, but yeah. as you can see here, it's just plankton yes. being collected in the gills and fired out. It's science. Yes, it's just science. It's regular <laughs> science. Um, all right. Ooh, bite. Okay. Uh, so let's strengthen Slick Sammy. And what do you think uh, for Sammy's new military title? Uh, I mean, I don't know how long these names can be, but if you can fit in like a LT. Okay. Yeah. 
Actually, what I'm thinking is, actually, no, that's the maximum length. Let me just say, just take out the slick and replace that with something. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Try Sammy. Okay. Used to be slick. Now he's Finally dry. dried off. It's kind of hard to dry off a fish when it's underwater, but we'll just we'll just ignore that. <laughs> All right. Uh, and Doctor Claw Man. Oops. Formation. Let's get back in here. Remove is just sort of hovering in the middle of the screen now. Yeah. So we'll do five percent. No, we'll do five percent growth yeah. on Doctor Clawman. We could get some more uh, allies here. We want to save up some. Yeah. Um, and Dr. Clawman has become, sorry, this, this game control is so janky. <laughs> Professor. Oh. How about uh, Claw PhD? Yeah, 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 yeah. Prof. Good. Great. <laughs> cool. So it seems like we are good to go. Uh, do, can we? Do we have enough to breed more allies? I, I tried to do something in there before we started, and I couldn't. Wow. Okay. So we've unlocked some new critters that we can did, breed ooh, here. Ooh, that looks like a crab. What, what's over here? Man, these controls are so bad. So if you click those, does anything happen? Let me, let me just move. I'm, I'm using like five different control implements right now. <laughs> so we don't have a mouse. Oh, here we go. Does that do anything? Mackerel. Yes. Let's yeah. Let's make a mackerel. <laughs> Boom shakalaka. Oh, good. So let's put we that in our squad number. here. Yeah, mackerel number one. All right, what's his name? What are we going to call this mackerel? I like the name mackerel. There's something about it that sounds delicious. How about delicious. mackerel? <laughs> there we go. All right, so we've got a squad Mac of... Um, Couple lobsters, mm -hmm. couple couple uh, sardines, and a mackerel. So let's uh, let's begin our mission. Nothing you can't do with a couple sardines, lobster, and a mackerel. Engage reef. So I think sure. that's maybe reef selection where you spawn. Oh, okay. And I think yellow is the next one. We although I don't know if I defeated that last reef. It's yeah. a little bit uh, up in the air. All right. Well, let's commence operations. All right. We're going back in. Dive, uh, dive, fatty dive. Fatty acids with the. Uh, whoa! Did I change? I think I changed which, which animal. Which one you're I am. controlling? Yeah. Now, what I'm curious is, can you switch between them? Are you stuck? Uh, I, uh, not on the fly, I don't think. Uh, but here's a cool thing: is controls are different, so I don't need to feather that thing to fly anymore. Now, when I hit that left bumper, I sorry, that left trigger, I you charge turbo. forward, and I, I jump forward to do a little bite. I like it. All right. Um, yeah, we're gonna play as as our friend the sardine here for a minute. Mm-hmm. All right, uh, so let's go find some targets. Are these enemies? Yes. Yep. Get that sardine. Lock on. Lock on achieved. We have lock. We're going in. Going in. Garfield, flank him. Flank him, Garfield. There we go. Boom shaka laka. Oh, Lobo's getting right in there. Lobo's lighting him up. Was my my, my uh, controlling of Lobo met his fate. I'm sorry. It's all right. Yes, get that delicious fish DNA. All right, cool. We're doing good. Uh, let's move on. What are you? Is that a starfish? I'm not a starfish. Starfish now is it's food. are nasty. They're really gross. They, uh... Here's that barracuda that is real scary. There's a video of a, of a giant starfish I've seen that's like... It's like a giant slice of pizza, like big pizza pie size. Like, and it's got like 12 arms. And there's Gross. a video of sped up footage where you can see it like yes. shifting and crawling along the sea floor and it's it's disturbing. Yeah. I so just I just noticed that you're wearing a very nautically appropriate hat. Great I mean work. when else? When else but now. Alright, I've got homing rockets on my sardine. We're gonna fire some of these. Excuse, off. excuse me, homing shoes. Uh, yeah, sorry, homing plankton. Yes. <laughs> oh geez, these are powerful sardines. I should back off here. Oh geez. See if I can now you can change your formation. I see. Yeah. So right now we're running a uh, kind of a wall, sort of a wall formation. If we go up to here, we go to shoal formation, which allies shoal. circle me. Oh, I like that. We're doing good on food. We're doing shoal. good on HP. We're doing okay on stamina. Mm -hmm. um, let's go to the next undiscovered reef. Okay. This way. Let's 
kind of your fish sonar. I think that yeah, makes... sort of fish, fish vision. Got some scout prawn. Got some prawns. Fucking prawns. Did you see that bad movie, District mm -hmm. 9? Uh, yeah, I did. I actually liked it. Yeah, it's all right. <laughs> it's a fun movie. I like the part where he's in the mech suit. Yeah. But I just like the way he, uh, people with the uh, um, Afrikaans accent say... Prawn. Prawn. That was, um... Neil Blumkin. Neil Blomkamp. Yeah. He made some movies. He did. He made one good movies. <laughs> It was District 9, right? He was. Did, did, did he make another good movie? Uh, not a good one. He made Elysium, which I'll say... I did see that. ...had some interesting art direction. I kind of yep. like its sci-fi style. Yeah. However... Oh, prawns are tough. We're getting the fuck out of here. Kind of a paper-thin movie. <laughs> Very paper-thin movie, but again, great performance by Charlton Copley. That's that's true, actually. He oh, was, we're, uh, we're hemorrhaging here. We gotta we gotta get to a, a unreached reef or yeah. we gotta get some food in this. Did we get away from the prawns? Claw Esquire is trying to follow you, but I don't know if the rest of your team followed suit. Rally, rally to me. No, now come just to me. Firing at will. I think you got to help out. I think you're okay now. Okay, we're good. Oh, those prawns are not leaving Claw Esquire alone. Mm. I hate them with my life. There you go. There you go. Get that prawn DNA up in your tongue. It's a good uh, faint. You drew them in. And yeah. Some. The question is: Is he the only member of the team left? Red Frog Crib. Sorry. Wait, red frog crab? Red frog crab. One word. Red frog crab. <laughs> red frog crab. Red frog crab. Red frog crab. Oh, it's a decoy. Oh, good. Good eye. All oh, these prawns and their decoys. Oh. Oh, that red frog crab is still there. Oh, we gone. gotta gain we gotta gain altitude here. Some pretty good music in this game. Oh God, Doctor Claw's dead. I think you might be the last one. Oh, I'm the last survivor, the sole survivor, the designated survivor, well. starring. Who's that guy from Designated Survivor? I don't know. Uh, Keeper. Keeper Sutherland. Yeah. There we go. I wonder what the uh, chain of command works in, in the fish. The fishes. Oh God, we lost everybody. Yeah. To this, to these prawns. Prawn. Prawns. Oh man, look at that! I didn't realize this game had so much uh, realistic gore. Oh God, it's okay. I've got plenty of HP. It's just that I, I, it uses my stamina to fire back at this this prawn. Mm -hmm. So I got it. Oh wow! Well, it even gives you like the little lead the target thing. No, it's it's just it's so like good. they took the asset out of Ace Combat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes there you go now if you can just go to a new uh yeah i gotta get to a reef and then i can make some make some prawns i'm gonna eat some sponges real quick yeah. uh i need to find some other little crusty treats for me crustacean sink i think that might be a Avril says, uh, more like Soul Surf Iver. Mm. Good one. Uh, all right. So the closest one is Crustacean Sink. Yeah. But that is an undiscovered one. So let's go to, um, let's go to Modern Sculpture. Right. And re 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 regroup there. I'm not sure. Is that a, maybe it's a fish that's a Modern Sculpture. Well, there's something there. Okay. Yeah, there's a sculpture under here. Okay, All right, let's see. So, so is our squad okay? Yeah, it seems like they, they've respawned. Uh, hmm. But we have an opportunity here to uh, change up our team. Mm -hmm. um, so let's... Could give the Mac roll a try. See, what, like, if you yeah, play Yeah, yeah, let's, let's play as Mac RL. Good. Uh, I'm so, also curious if you breed, uh, if we can get a crab. Yeah, see what we can get for... Are you a crab? Uh, I think it is. Yes. Cool. So we've got a crab in our in our army. Uh, Do we have room for a yes. crab? Yes, we got room for one more. Cool. Uh, and that means we get to name a crab. Mm -hmm. So Clayton, I'm going to let you do the honors. Okay. So let me get in here real quick and mm, details. All right. Name. Who lives in a pineapple? By the crab 
Always after that crab. But yeah. All right. That's a character, right? Let me. See. I, I didn't even see what you named him. Squidward. Yep. There we go. <laughs> he likes the burgers, the crab patties. I, yep. That's the thing that that character is known for. He's always trying to steal the recipe from SpongeBob. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad that we're both 90s kids and we both remember the mm -hmm. plot of SpongeBob SquarePants. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, commence operations. Actually, let's try to let's try to power up first. Yeah, give our uh, our crab man. Uh, okay, God, it's so this menu <laughs> system is so inscrutable. <laughs> All right, Mac RL, Mac RL, and then we go to here and go to D details, and then we go to strengthen. <laughs> And then we will grow Mac RL 20%. We're going to be generous to Mac RL. You know what? We're going to go 15%. Now what if you keep going? Just keep going all the keep way. Keep going. Keep going. That's a powerful Get ready. Mackerel. Stop. Okay. Okay. Very powerful Mac. <clears throat> yes. And Alrighty. squittered. We're good then. Dive, dive. Dive, dive. <laughs> It's a lot of uh, possible metaphors this game could have. All right, have. so the mackerel's pretty big. Oh, wow, rapid fire on this mackerel. Ooh, it's a like little bit fire. slower, sort of tanky. Yeah. The, the mackerel's a little bit tanky. The meta on the mackerel, I think, needs to be tuned a little bit. I think mackerel's kind of OP. Where's our team? Are they all here? They're, they're all here. The whole, whole squad's here. Where's Squidward? Started, started at the ocean bottom. Now we're here. Mm, no, sorry. Hmm. Wow. They can just blast. That's his bullet. Oh, you zoom like that. You got a whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> it's like a sniper shot. Dang. Okay, so let's go after our next reef. Okay. This way, unreached reef, seven meters. Now, there's a. We want to find the reefs, but to what end? Have you figured? Uh, we just want to really kind of take over the whole damn ocean. Okay. Yeah. Just it's just con it's about. All right. Engaging crabs. Look out for that. All right. D dry Sammy's in there. Yeah, I gotta gonna... get in and do some melee attacks. He's not doing well. You defeat prawn. That crab has some hard armor. All oh, these prawns. Did he? Oh, did you destroy? Wait. No, 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 no. Did I destroy what? I thought I saw a hermit crab down there, but. Hmm. Okay. Being a little frenetic now. Yeah. Got your homing homing plankton. Going in for melee attack on this prawn. I think he's got prawn armor. Wow, prawns are fast. Did you? Oh my god. Yeah. Just took a bite out of that prawn. I'm going in for it again on this one. Yeah. That is powerful. Doing good on health and HP. Everything's fine. That prawn just clipped through the. Oh, that was a decoy. Mm. Tricky. Prawns are tricky. I can now enter the crustacean sink. A boom, shaka shaka. All right, cool. Entering the sink. Mission complete. Cooking is culture. Since losing the necessity to eat, we do have not produced a single new form of culture. This shall change on the day of rebirth. <laughs> I am fascinated by this game's lore. <sighs> I just, I really want to know why all the fish are revolting. Mm -hmm. Hopefully we can find this out. So there, are these different teams? Yeah, you can have multiple uh, squads Oh, cool, ready. different lineups. God, this interface is A+. All right, let's let's um, let's put together another, uh, another, I guess let's, I, I, we should probably rotate out Dry Sammy okay. uh, for somebody new. Remove. You can get a prawn. I saw a prawn in there. Yeah, let's, let's get a, a prawn in there. Breed. Got our own prawn. There we go. Ugh, I hate them. I just love the big video game screen. <laughs> it says reproduce. I, I don't know what freeze does. Put it on ice. I'm guessing that's, that's what it is That's how you usually like. transport fish. Okay. So the prawn's abilities, plankton pistol, arthropod missile. Mm. Um, and a tail attack. Okay. So let's rename it. Go ahead and name that for me. Okay. I know a lot of people wanted Larry. Larry. Larry the prawn. Mm -hmm. uh, and let's strengthen 
a little bit so it can fit in with our, his friends. Mm -hmm. Oh, we spent our re wait. Did we spend our resources? We, we dumped all of our resources into um into Garfield X. I thought it was Mac RL. Mac RL. Yeah, you're yeah. right. Um, because I th uh, but I think we were also using resources to purchase new to breed. Yes. I'm not sure yet if it's yeah. the same resource. I don't know either. Um, all right, so here's our current squad. Can Let's, we uh, can yep. we change Max name? Yeah, sure. Can we. Uh. <laughs> Thanks. He's evolved. All right, return. Prepare to commence operations. Oh, that's a big map. I see. We're slowly exploring it. Yeah. Okay. It's an open world. I do know that. So let, let's spawn here so we can go over to that new yellow reef, mm -hmm. which we haven't uh, haven't conquered yet. Beautiful. So I think this game was actually kind of a sequel. I think there's another thing called like Ace Aquarium or Aquarium Stars or yeah. something. So this isn't the first of this. Uh, First of the Fish genre. combat sim genre. All right. Uh, let's get in shoal formation. Allies encircle me as we approach the target beyond reached reef. Uh, stay frosty uh, and just uh, watch my six. Keep your eyes peeled. It's quiet. Too quiet. Mm -hmm. There's a wagon. Uh, approaching unreached reef now. Let's do scanning for hostiles. Nothing. We have mackerel incoming. We mackerel have multiple incoming. mackerel. They're coming from above. Whoa. Mackerel's high. Wow, we're just mulching them, turning them into chum. We've got a good team now. We do. We're getting strong. Soon the ocean will be ours. Bite him, bite him. Oh, good call. He's oh. biting me. Bite back. Oh, he got you bad, actually. God damn. Wow. Okay, time to run. Time to run. Time to run. Oh, hang on. We can now <laughs> enter the wagon of hay. <laughs> we didn't make capitalize hay. <laughs> <laughs> Neo Aquarium, I guess was the name Neo of the game. Neo Aquarium, thank you. Thanks, Adam. Uh, give a try on the mackerel. Yeah, go for it. Uh, let's uh, go, go ahead. Never Just piloted go, a mackerel. Go, go ahead and rename that mackerel for me. All right. I think uh, R.L. Stein has earned a new title. Yeah, he quickly he made work. He's moving up through the ranks really quickly. Probably Oops, gonna make I general. Didn't. That's okay. okay. <laughs> I don't know these controls. All right, he gets one more chance. Can really cruise that mackerel. Yeah. I'm excited oh. to unlock some of the bigger fish like tuna. Um, How deep does this go? Cod. Wow. What could do with a good cod. We're starting to lose the sunlight a little bit. Mm -hmm. How, let's keep going down. See what's down there. It's got to be something. Let's do. Keep an eye on that stamina though. You're draining pretty quick. I was turboing. I don't need to. I did find an unreached reef nearby. But how deep can we go? Well, pretty deep, but I'm not sure there's much purpose. <laughs> no. Okay. Well, maybe we can use this to advantage and to attack from it. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. Okay, so clown triggerfish have pretty strong armor. You're going to want to melee attack them, but they, I don't know if we're ready for this yet. This looks like a powerful, powerful squadron. Okay. Well, we've got lionfish. There's nothing we can do. Engage. Oh God. Mackerel and glee. Mm -hmm. Labo, where are you? Uncle Andros! I gotta save up my stamina to fire. I don't know if I can bite a lionfish. It might be a bad idea. Okay, it doesn't seem to be hurting me like I would expect that to. Right. This is like a... Captures incoming organisms with low cavitation? Ooh. I don't know what that means. Yeah. Yes, we can make lionfish now. Now we can assemble a lionfish. We have the necessary components. We have the technology. Uh oh. Okay, we got a straggler hermit crab. Just surrender. Your lionfish have been destroyed. Oh, okay. Okay. Don't really know what's going on half the time in this game, but that's okay. Okay, let's do decoys. Interesting. Okay. Oh, that was my decoy. All right, let's go to that. 
surprised they followed me all the way down here. But oh, yeah, there's ooh, a macro. There's another macro. Got a little macro rivalry. My rivalry. <laughs> mackerel rivalry. Mackerel rivalry. That's a hard one. Mackerel rivalry. <laughs> mackerel rivalry. <laughs> a lively mackerel. Ri La <laughs> reframe the lively mackerel rivalry. Re reframe the reframe the lively mackerel rivalry. Reframe the lively mackerel rivalry. Reframe the lively rack. <laughs> Reframe them. Have you have you ever listened to Simone's um, vocal warm ups? Yeah, she does them before video game theater sometimes. Yeah, it's, I, it's she does the the bitter butter one. The bitter butter, yeah. Susie's pat a bada pat a bitter bitter butter a but pat a bitter butter. They're tough. <laughs> reframe the lively, reframe the lively rat mackerel rivalry. Reframe the lively mackerel rivalry. <laughs> the Ball State boys. <laughs> this music's getting good. I'm just trying to focus on this. Oh, I'm out of. Okay. I really am really having a tough time managing my. Uh, what is it called? Stamina. Okay, I did it. I think once again I have allowed my team. They've all expired. To die. I don't yeah, know. you should probably oh, get back okay, to it. Got... Oh, no, okay, L Labo and Claw Esquire are I still alive. I might have gotten them stuck in this pit. <laughs> yeah, maybe it's time to uh, uh, revisit our reef and power up again because we've we've accumulated some resources. True. Um. If there's no enemies around this, I'm just gonna go to this reef. Sardine, I can take a sardine. Hell yeah, take that sardine. Ch chomp on that sardine. Well, first, I gotta save up. Actually, maybe I can't. Oh god. Oh dear. You're you're being airholed by this sardine. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, one's down. One's down, but you gotta get some health in you, otherwise you're you're done for. Oh, I am. Oh jeez, and no, he has backup. Good? Oh boy, you got 8 HP, my friend. Yes! No one can take out on the Mac. Did you? Yeah, okay, so that reef is, R. is ours Stein. now. Natural reef. Reefer Sutherland. <laughs> is, that, uh, is that who you're gonna rename them? Mm -hmm. Good idea. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, let's try out a new class because we've been playing as Mackerel for a while. We've Good idea. So first we're going to rename, oops, hang on. Formation, go down here. We got to rename Mac R. L. Stein. Mm. <laughs> Tonight. <laughs> but All now right. he's gonna be, he's no longer commander. He's no longer commander. He's been stripped of his command because he let too many of his you're right. You let some good people die out there. Some Mac RL, RL Stein. It was Larry's first battle. All right, let's breed. Didn't bring him home. Let's breed a new commander. All Ooh, right. a lionfish. A lionfish. And a barracuda. Cool. We can get a lot. I, I feel like it's been a while since we played as a crustacean, though. Fair enough. I think that one at 40, I think that's a regular crab. Yeah. yeah red frog crab. Red Reproduce. Frog. It don't mind if I do. RFC. Uh, all right. Let's details. Let's strengthen this so we can go toe to toe, claw to claw with the rest of the creatures in the sea. Mm -hmm. Go about twenty percent there. Do you okay. feel the same way about crabs as you do about lobsters? No, yeah, they're disgusting. Okay. So I just got to fix these glasses. Uh oh. Uh oh. This might not work. Hang on. Oh, no. Nope. Yeah, I got him. Hold Boom. In. All right. Uh, okay. Red frog crab is our commander. Mm-hmm. Enter the chain of command. All right. Okay. Oh, you didn't re. Well. Oh yeah, we should rename our frog crab. Our frog crab. <laughs> hmm. Um. Crab. <laughs> 
crab. Uh, hmm. Red frog crab. Red frog crab. Maybe red fraud crab. Red. Frogs. <laughs> I don't know. Was that frog based cell phone company? Uh, Is it Blue Frog or something? Blue, I don't remember a frog based. It's like a frog commercial that no one liked. The, with the, with the, the annoying frog? The annoying frog. Was that for a cell phone company? I don't even know. It was ringtones. It was a ringtone. Ring oh, okay. Yeah. Back when you bought ringtones from. Yeah, you go Separate online and company. buy some ringtones. Beautiful. Okay, so this is a ground-based attack, so I need to use left a little trigger. Smooth. Interesting. And an enemy. So, wow, that's a cool... So the red frog crab is a sniper. It's got some phasers. Which way? This way. Okay. So what do we have? We have phaser. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, that's so cool. Homing, shed shell, mm -hmm. decoy. You can take off a limb. Mm -hmm. Which is this pretty cool because I know that lobsters, I know crabs can definitely take their limbs can off. They, can they regrow theirs, though? I don't think they can, right? I'm not sure about that. <laughs> I don't think crabs can. All right, so here's Unreached can. Reef. Submarine. Oh, God. So these are submarines. Ooh. Can we, are we strong Wait, enough to take down a submarine? They're not far away, though. <laughs> No, those are just very small submarines. Or I guess. you were, were very large. Oh, no, that's a car oh, right God, there. Oh, God, they're fucking me right up. Yeah, okay, we're not ready to face submarines yet. Ooh. They just turned me into... This mission was a catastrophe, Red Frogster. You have been relieved of command. I'm going rogue. I'm going to need a mackerel, a couple of shrimp. going to need a symbol of team. All right, so we, we will avoid the submarines. We're not ready for the <laughs> submarines yet. Red Frogster, you weren't uh, authorized to take this mission on. Listen, I'm out there, I'm under pressure. Sometimes I gotta make decisions. Oh, jeez. All right, let's, uh, let's go, let's look for another, another point here. It's not gonna, not, not, we're not ready for that yet. Just bring my Larry home. He's dead. He's dead, and it's my fault. There's nothing I can do that'll bring him back. But I can make the bastards who did this pay. <laughs> Fuck up to see an enemy. Only thing that makes me feel anymore. <laughs> you see the fucking terrible trailer for that new Death Wish? Yeah, oh god. It looks so bad. Uh, you know, let's not get into all the ways that it's bad. It's right very now. bad. It looks so terrible. It's. All right, lionfish. We can fuck up some lionfish. Yeah. Snipe them from a distance. So I, I guess it didn't even occur to me that uh, maybe this, the last night, was the Oscars. Yeah. Uh, Shape of Water did win. Did win, yeah. So this is maybe something of a like. We're not, we're, this doesn't address anything about the love no. component of that, but there are fish things in this, I yeah. guess, re memorials in in celebration of. Yeah, this is fish -based celebrating movie. the love of fish. I'm trying real hard. Yeah, to, yeah, <laughs> I'm you gotta sorry. thread that needle. All right, I, I gotta but, switch uh, up to I gotta switch up to my um. My congratulations to, to Guillermo. Guillermo del Toro, amazing work actually. The, the, I was thinking about Guillermo del Toro the other day and how mm -hmm. sort of hilariously inconsistent his work is in terms yeah. of like the respect it gets. Yes. Like, I think he's always a fun director to watch. Like yeah. even when he's directing fucking Blade Two. Like right. Blade Two is a really fun movie, but like stuff like yeah, you know, let's what's my melee attack? The hell Whoa, yeah, nice. Daddy O. I feel like the cool. Hell, the Hellboy movies kind of like, also like very fun movies that like, but aren't even brought up in conversation of like right, good yeah. superhero movies. So right, often, yeah, but. yeah. Um, Incredible practical effects. Love that about his movies. Yeah, he loves he loves that Doug Jones. And honestly, like Shape of Water is just sort of like him saying, "Hey, Doug Jones, you want a bunch of people to talk about you again? Let's, <laughs> let's do it, man." Um, yeah, Doug Jones kicks ass. Mm -hmm. I think I need some food or something. My, my maximum stamina has depleted <laughs> over the course of these battles. Uh -huh. <laughs> what does the surface <laughs> world look like? <laughs> Let's take a peek. Whoop. 
Not great. Not great. Not good. Not, not looking good up here. Let's, let's stay down here. All right, we're gonna take down some red frog crabs when we engage sniper. Yeah, uh, oh. did you enjoy Shape of Water? I have not seen it yet. Really? Yeah, I really want to. Um, I liked it a lot. It was a lot of fun. There's been a lot of movies to see this uh, last couple months. It's actually been a fairly good early and late year for movies. Mm -hmm. um, I really enjoyed Shape of Water. I'm excited to see Annihilation. Mm -hmm. Did see that. Black Panther was fun. Um, Another good one. And yeah, I want to see Shape of Water. I like that uh, Isle of Dogs. Oh, is that is that out? No, not yet, but very yeah. soon. God, this is Looks a powerful good. red frog crab we're up oh, against here. I'm gonna go in there and try to get some melee attacks on him. Oh, there we go. Eat that DNA. DNA consumed. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I feel like that's kind of a trope of games that DNA becomes the like, just this power up that's floating. Oh, just grab some DNA. Yeah, that's mine now. You now. Can, now you can make a lionfish or whatever. God, there's a lot of a lot of stuff down here. Food, well, future food for, for me. That starfish. All right, where's the closest reef? I need to power up. <laughs> Gotta get strong. I do need to. I can face my nemesis, the submarine. The submarine killed Larry. <laughs> God, this music is great. All right, there's an unreached reef down here, 18 meters. My stamina is pretty low, but I think we should go for it. Yeah. Engaging long range Some lasers. Sorries. Sorry. It's a bunch of Canadians so who are, sorry, who've hurt sorry. my feelings. Sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry. Oh, geez. Sorry, buddy. <laughs> oh, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> what the fuck are these? What's a sorry? Yeah, it's just some fish. Are they going to hurt me? I'm not sure if they, if you've just not hit one yet and triggered their warning, like, combat, engage. All right, we're going. So I've cast a decoy. Nice. So we're just going for it, I think. Missile's incoming. Wow, I can't hurt these. Huh. Are they just very fast? Are they neutral? Are they neutral <laughs> fish? Pacifists? Oh, now, you're, okay. By getting near it, they... Oh, Jesus! Oh, whoa, no. whoa, 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 I am sorry. Oh, boy. All right, all right. I'm going to have to yeah, take command. Yeah, take over. I'm going uh, to give our lionfish a try. I'm just not sure if the crab has, has what it takes. Hmm. Okay. Do we make a? Wait, I don't think we've made one yet. No, yeah, we haven't. We haven't made a. Uh, w made a what? Lionfish. No, I don't know if we have enough materials. Oh, we're lack. Or a barracuda. Oh, you need resources. That's why. Okay. All right, so we should go farm some resources, yeah. then we can make a. Okay. Well, I'm gonna see if I can strengthen. Is he? Oh, he's full. Okay. Interesting. Okay, a little powerful. Dang. So if we go out and we we, we hmm. gather, I'm gonna try a you gonna try shrimp. playing as a prawn? Yeah. Cool, cool call. I bet it's fast. Yeah. Okay. Do we have two lobsters? Oh, a bunch of different crabs. Now, nah, red frogster, you are out. Why can't I freeze only a couple of them? It's just incomprehensible what's going on here. Bring, uh, we got back tonight still. Um, now I'll just keep it. Keep yeah, it there we go. Okay. So, prawn, you can just swim too. Okay. And you can move real fast. He only has homing missiles. Sort of the, the Corsair of the. Uh... Yeah, he's fast. Okay, I'm gonna try. Cool. Yeah, so I think that red stuff in the lower left corner is the material that you use to, to create new animals from. Do the 14 out of 460 down there. Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, okay. Lion fish. Ooh, this is good farming. Focus our fire. Yeah, don't don't forget to change up your formations here. Yeah, I was trying to do the uh, I think I'm on the formation I want. The shoal formation. Well, that's around me, but I ooh. Okay, we got oh god. Oof. Holy moly. So you are sort of a glass cannon as a shrimp. Yeah, apparently. Hmm. You know what? I think it's it's we just gotta bring uh gotta bring back our closer. Yeah, Mac tonight. Mac tonight. Hmm. Hmm. Not sure how else to get by these guys. Okay. So I want Ultra Pierce. Helming scale. So C says surround your attack target. That's what I want. I want us to focus, destroy one, mm -hmm. move on. Yep. Hit and run. Yeah. Don't rely too much on those homing missiles. I think they're they're you know they're they're good in some they, senses, but they're they're not very strong. And they're taking a lot of they take a lot of uh, take a lot of your stamina. Huh. Searching. Yeah, that'll lock on if you if something's in range. Hmm. There we go. Okay, I've got a target. Where's my team? Are they not following me? Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Oh, yeah, change their formation. They're, they're in free attack mode right now. I think. Uh, yeah, there you go. <coughs> or maybe not. Oh, shit. Are Ooh, free DNA. Fighting something? Love that. Get the DNA. Mm -hmm. Yes, delicious. All right, you've got you've got some more building materials now, which is good. Um, yeah, if you click in the left thumbstick, it'll direct you to the nearest reef. It's, okay, mackerel sight. Mackerel. Okay, snipe these mackerel. Hit and run. Get above them. Get the sun in their eyes. Boom. Whoa! Holy moly! Doing some fish stunts. I keep saying holy moly, and I literally could say holy mackerel. That's true. You, you're you're leaving very a lot of opportunities on the table here. Acquired mackerel gene. Eat it. Eat it. Eat. Literally eat him. I'm trying. Oh man. Red Frogster's getting peppered and bashed. Don't yeah. even know where Professor uh, Esquire. Uh, <laughs> Mackerel Esqu Squadron is powerful. Yeah, just trying to keep moving. Not giving a chance. Stay on them. Yes. Oh man, a fleet of lionfish just came in though. That's all right. They, they're not engaged with you yet. Okay, we got our whole team ready. Let's get them. Oh, you're you're pretty low on HP. Are you sure you can handle this mission? I think so. Just hmm. with nettle there. <laughs> Spins around. Ah, get it. Whoa, lionfish. out of the water. Can't breathe. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oof, oh, jeez. Took a big geez, bite geez. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. No. These are these are powerful lionfish. Made uh, a mistake. Yeah. Time to run. Time to run. Get low. Get below radar range. I'm just gonna fly into the claws of this hermit crab. Do not engage. Do not engage. I'm running out of space. Oh no! Oh, they're still on you. Ah. you well, you lured them down here where you yeah. can kill them. No. Nope. nope. <laughs> <sighs> Darn. Darn it. Okay, we'll give it one last try here. Mac tonight was definitely an improvement, though. Yeah, Mac tonight's is a strong contender. Okay. Just gonna get some DNA. Yep. In out. In and out. Just a quick DNA run. Okay. Got some organic material. Oh, that's far away. Some more mackerel. Okay. Alright, I, I think those hermit crabs would be an easy target. 
hermit crab. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go down there and farm their, their delicious fluids. Make sure my team is following me. They'll be here when shit pops off. Squilla? Squilla? What the fuck's a squilla? Ugh, I don't like it. Ew. Oh my goodness. It's like a weird lobster. Oh, it kind of looks like a the punching lobster. The punching? Oh, ooh. I forget what that's called. Hammer, hammer lobster. Uh, um, yeah, it's... Oh, he's very strong. He is. You should not have engaged that squilla. should not have engaged the squilla. Come on, team. It's just us against him. Uh, let me protect me. Drop a decoy. Wait, did we get him? Uh, I don't think so. I'm not sure where he went there. All right, maybe you're okay. Huh. Well, alrighty then. Okay. Get these prawn, I guess. Yeah. Okay, there's a hermit crab. Let's get him, boys. All right. Larry, you got this? Coming in hot. Beautiful. Light him up. Light him up. Guns, guns, guns. Get that delicious DNA material. Beautiful. Yes. Okay. All right, cool. You, you've got a bit more uh, juice for building now. Get to this natural reef. Yeah, let's look for more hit and run targets after this, too. <laughs> Avril. Avril's talking about building a weapon to surpass mackerel gear. Hmm? Mackerel gear? Mackerel <laughs> gear. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we've leveled up. No, we have we haven't leveled up. We we, just, we we've we've refilled. Let's do a couple more hit and them. runs. Yeah. Let's see. So like yeah, we get a tiny amount of genetic material from these things. Yeah, I'm just not getting anything on the food. Okay. okay, so we can take that trigger fish. Clown. Huh. Melee attacks are good against trigger fish. Oh, I keep forgetting about melee attacks. He's bleeding. We got him. Leaking. You hit the tank. He's got like a mucus protection. Yeah, that's a shield. Ugh. Firing back. Damn. I'm just gonna stay far away. And get All right. Shots. You're nuking him down. You're nuking him down. You got him. 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 Boom. Cool. Got those trigger fish bits. Beautiful. It's like a parrotfish. Yeah. Those big lips. We're eating the coral. Do they eat coral? Yeah. Really? Yeah, clownfish or, or, or parrotfish at least, which that looked like. Yeah. Have kind of like hard almost beaks. Yeah. And they literally eat um <laughs> they literally eat coral. I've learned this from uh, watching Blue Planet and Planet Earth and stuff, that they then later poop out the calcium. Like, mm -hmm. they don't actually eat that part of it. And that is where a lot of the uh, dust and kind of sand uh, comes from in coral reefs. Really? It's kind of like a circle of life huh. thing going It's beautiful. There. Yeah. Probably getting that science extremely wrong, but I yeah. just remember the part about... Because I, I, I always enjoy in those when um, Attenborough's a narrator has to delicately get around the fact that he's talking about yes, poop. the castings. <laughs> oh, sometimes he's a little cheeky about oh, it. Oh, yeah, he like, is. But I just enjoy the ways that they think up to not just say, like, this fish shits out coral. <laughs> the clownfish makes a trip to the loo and the circle of life continues. <laughs> I'm David Attenborough. D D D David Attenborough. David Attenborough. I'm trying to find my David Attenborough voice. David. The only way I can find my David Attenborough voice is by saying, David Attenborough. Say saying Michael Caine. Michael Caine. Michael Caine. My name. 
My name is David Attenborough. <laughs> My name is David Attenborough. <laughs> this is this is terrific dumb. content. Yeah. Not even sure. Okay, sardine. I could take all the sardine. That's a lot of sardines. Do I have my backup? No, I don't. Fatty Acids asks if this is a post-apocalyptic game, and I believe it is actually, yeah. Yeah. Um, or well, doesn't like ask. Theorizes this might be a post-apocalyptic game, but canonically, the opening of the game says that uh, I think humanity is, is done for, and it is only the fish now. There's some little submarines for some reason. Hmm. We're not really sure yet. We only saw... Maybe they're drones. Yeah. They're just sort of sort of like uh, uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. They're just drones left wandering around the Earth. Man, that was a no great purpose. game. Yeah, remember that one? Fuck. There's some like uh, some of uh, that game's content in Monster Hunter right now. Yeah, yeah. Maybe actually, right now, I think you can unlock uh, um, the main character from... Aloy. Aloy. Yeah, you can unlock Aloy as a player playable character in Monster Hunter right now. I have. It's a sick collabo. Gotten into a sticky situation. What's your sticky sitch? I think I've found the edge of the earth, but I have not found it on each a reef. Ooh. Ooh. I think that's on the other side of this wall. Pinky in chat says David DeVito. Uh, now I'm imagining Danny DeVito narrating all of planet Earth. Uh. Fuck. I, I, I want to get as much out of Danny DeVito as we can in the yeah. time we have left with him. Get him in a nature doc. Get him in everything. Like, start the Danny DeVito archive. Just like, I want to have Danny DeVito content. Like, Reserved in amber for future generations. Yeah. Yes. I want Danny. Honestly, you know, I want Danny DeVito shot into space on a satellite in like a cryopod. Just like, first of all, so he can live beyond us. And also so that like... Alien civilizations, if they ever need to know anything about our planet, they'll just find Danny DeVito and they'll be like, oh, this oh. is everything we need to know. <laughs> just Danny DeVito encased in amber and just an archive of all of his tweets. He used to post pictures of his feet occasionally. <laughs> it was really good. And then when he, he tweeted at Antonin Scalia and told him to retire, yeah. it was <laughs> maybe one of the best tweets ever. Thank you. Thank you, DeVito. I did not see the M&M's commercial with, with Danny DeVito. Oh, he's in that. And I was glad that they gave him money for it. It's yeah. a good thing. Yeah. Where is my team? I have been disconnected, stranded, and it's... N oh. Ooh, DNA. Ooh, you DNA acquired a sardine gene. Stuff. What I really need to do is find a... Sardine gene Okerlund. Some kind of... Um, reef for me to go to that is not surrounded by enemies. Oh, oh going through the uh, environment. Yeah, all right. Death Note says that Danny DeVito is the R-rated Jack Black, <laughs> which is kind of sad that Jack Black is no longer no, the R-rated R -rated <laughs> Jack Black. Yeah. Jack Black feels like he's really sort of stalled out in terms of the stuff that he does uh -huh. and like his bits. Like he's like, I don't know, maybe for like the last 15 years, like he's just been like the wacky guy who shows up and goes, squid to me to me. And like, he's like, yeah. He's, yeah. We remember it. We remember liking that. <laughs> he was supposed to be like that King Kong movie was supposed to really, I think, do it for him. Allow him yeah. to branch out. Right. And, sort of break out into more serious roles. And I don't think it did. And now he's doing Jumanji. Yeah. Which I hear is better than you would think. I heard that particularly his role of having to portray a like whole like storyline of how that works. Yeah. Is that like his role he actually does like give justice to it, which you wouldn't expect. I don't huh. want to spoil anything. You okay. can look into it, but um yeah. Maybe there's more more to uh, Jack Black than meets the eye. I think there is. I think Jack Black just has been unfortunately uh pigeonholed into certain types of roles. Um, Where are my reefs? Get that reef. All get my that guys reef are just like spread out across nothing. Do they all get stuck on the bottom of the ocean? I just want a reef. Is there a map? There is a bigger map. Interesting. Oh, okay. Hmm. 
Uh, folks in chat are talking about Bernie, which I guess is a very good Jack Black role that is a departure from his normal stuff, which I have not seen. So I should see that. Oh, yes. I think I saw that on Netflix. Yeah. Um, available on Netflix at some point in time. And, uh, okay. I was thinking I'm about uh, did did you see uh, Be Kind Rewind when that came out? Yeah, that yeah, was alright. That was fun. Yeah. Okay, time to upgrade. Garfield. Well, actually, can we breed a more powerful fish? Yes, we can. Okay, so barracuda or lionfish? Barracuda. Okay. Reproduce? Question mark. Don't mind if I do. Yes. Actually, I do mind if I do, but let's, uh, let's yeah, let's let's play as a barracuda. I want to see barracuda number one is a terrible name. Yeah, what do you got? <laughs> okay, and give him some strength. Oh, we can only grow him one percent. Dang. Okay. Actually, can you go back to the? Barracuda. Yeah, let me get Mac tonight on the team though. We don't want him. Going yeah, we, we, yeah, we don't want Mac tonight sitting on the bench for this for our final mission. Yeah, let's make this our final mission and then let's Take wrap up. up. <laughs> We're going to redistribute. Yep. All of the the wealth in the let's sea. Let's start a revolution. Let's see. We got Larry. We got Dr. Sammy. We got oh, Garfield X. I want all our heavy hitters on this. Labo. Mm -hmm. One last run. Once more into the breach. <laughs> I just, I, I want the, the slow-mo sequence of this team walking down the, oh, we, we've got an empty slot on the <laughs> Flopping team. Flopping down a hallway. Yeah. Fill, let's fill that empty slot. Oh, shite. Uh, dry Sammy. I think it's time to take him off the, off the rocks. Okay. We'll bring him back. One more. For one more mission. One more mission. He's retired, but uh, we brought him back in. Yep. Here this is go. this is the expendables of, of fish. Ooh, look at that cuda. Hold on, I'm I'm going to try to remember the limerick from the end of Expendables, or maybe it was Expendables too. There's a limerick in Expendables. Oh God, it's so bad. This fish has a good face. Okay, hold on. I like this fish's face. <laughs> Wow, okay, first of all, yes, great fish face. Then let, let's quickly go, okay, so you have broadside. Show me what broadside is. Oh my god. Yes. Yep, yep. oh, bah! <laughs> the mouth opening. <laughs> <laughs> Broadside's <laughs> firing. <laughs> Once more. <laughs> That's, I have that and bullet. Which shoots out of the open mouth. Love it, okay. Uh, I wanna see some broadsides happen. Yeah, let's go. Okay, so in the end of Expendables, or Expendables 2, don't mm -hmm. remember, uh, they're all hanging out in their stupid dad biker bar, and I think it's um, uh, Jason Statham's character recites a poem that he wrote about a character called Tool. And, okay. There once was a man called Tool, who to me was the epitome of cool. Good with a knife, bad with a wife. Try to take him out, you're a fool. Something like that. Real uh, badass. Yeah. yeah, really a cool cool way to end the movie. And then he throws a knife and it sticks into something else. And then it's like uh, saliva's every one of us is expendable theme plays. Um, God, what a terrible movie. Mm. Hold on. Let, let, let me could not stand up to a submarine in a barracuda. Let me Google the, the tool poem. Uh, <laughs> uh, um, Let's do Expendables. Make sure you want to make sure you got it right. Poem. Yeah, I want to make sure it's right. Expendables 1, poem by Jason Statham. <laughs> In an, okay. On wiki quote. He's, they're having a knife, knife throwing contest. Speaking the film's final lines in the form of a limerick. I once knew a man named Tool. To me, he was the epitome of cool. <laughs> He was good with a knife, bad with a wife. If you think you can beat me, prove it. If you think you can defeat me, cool tool, you've got to be a fool. Cool tool. <laughs> and then he throws the knife. Oh, we're getting and the summary this time. Eye. 
Let's see if there's any other good lines in this movie. Yes! I just bit a submarine and blew it up. This is a good game. I'm gonna eat another submarine. What up? Let me just read you some of the names of the characters from uh, from Expendables. Aye, aye. Gunnar Jensen. <laughs> Barney Ross. Yeah. Uh, Lee Christmas. Lee. Okay. Lee Christmas. Toll Road. Wait. Toll Road. <laughs> Is this his Christian name? Hail Caesar. Church. Church. Well, that probably is his Christian name. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh... Whew. Dan Payne. Not really trying. No, not really anymore. Anyways, this is a. Uh... This is terrible. Oh fuck! Sorry. I was gonna. Ra so yeah, we are gonna wrap. So how are these broadsides? Because well, they look so fucking. Well, so the rad. first time, uh, without you noticing, I quickly failed. But for some reason, this time I did way better. I don't know if it like counted the damage I did last time, but uh. That's you can now enter this, the dilapidated car, and you can breed a new life form, a the submarine. <laughs> uh, okay, uh, r r real quick. Uh -huh. uh, okay. Um, oh. Some taglines for the... We don't, we're lacking some of the necessary materials for breeding a submarine. Some of the taglines for the expendables, which we'll read you before we wrap up the uh -huh. stream. <laughs> First of all. Heroes today, legends forever. It's okay. Yeah, it's all right. Every movie has a hero. This one has all of them. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. Choose your weapon. Yeah. yeah. And the number one tagline for Expendables: Semper fight. <laughs> yeah. So this has been um this has been Ace of Seafood. Uh, uh, let's go out on some fish stunts. Yeah, do, let's go out on some fish stunts. This is out now on Nintendo Switch. It's out on PC. Wow. It's out on PS4. Wahoo! That it's was a cool easy. fish stunt. It's like yeah. Dolphin Olympics. Yeah. Oh, going for the full rotation, not quite making it. Uh, this has been our Expendables nostalgia cast. Uh, I'm Patrick Gill. Clayton Ashley. Uh, thank you for hanging out. We've got a bunch of streaming stuff coming up this week. Uh, tomorrow we've got Awful Squad, like always. Wednesday night we're coming back with uh, with Gil and Gilbert. We got another one of those coming up for you. Are you gonna hurt yourselves physically this time? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> uh, Thursday we've got Executables coming back with uh, Jenna and Jeff playing Snake Pass. Uh, what else do we have going on this week? Uh, there will probably be another Awful Squad. Yes, Tuesday is another Awful Squad. Me and Griffin will be streaming some more Monster Hunter later this week. Did you mention the the game, the strategy game that everyone likes, Into the Breach? Into the Breach, yeah. Uh, and Russ and Griffin will be streaming Into the Breach later this week. So we'll start putting these events up on the YouTube page so you can check them out and set reminders and stuff like that. Also, if you haven't already subscribed to the channel and you're here, do it. Yeah. Uh, like it a lot if you did that. Yeah, we'd like it a lot personally. Personally, that would that tell would your friends tell you tell your friends subscription tell, drive. Tell, tell all of the other fans of the film Expendables mm -hmm. um, that we're also fans and that we're regularly reciting Jason Statham's poems mm -hmm. from the film Expendables on our streams. My glasses just broke again. So, so that's a good time to wrap go. up. <laughs> Thanks everybody. Bye. Bye.